Doxylamine is a first-generation antihistamine. It can be used by itself as a short-term sedative and in combination with other drugs to provide nighttime allergy and cold relief. Doxylamine is also used in combination with the analgesics paracetamol acetaminophen, and codeine as an analgesic, comative preparation, and is prescribed in combination with vitamin B6 pyridoxine, to prevent morning sickness in pregnant women. Its fetal safety is A. In Briggs' Reference Guide to Fetal and Neonatal Risk. Medical uses It is used in the combination drug pyridoxine, doxylamine to treat nausea and vomiting of pregnancy. As of 2004, doxylamine and diphenhydramine were the agents most commonly used to treat short term insomnia. As of 2008, antihistamines were not recommended by the American Academy of Sleep Medicine for treatment of chronic insomnia. Due to the relative lack of efficacy and safety data, Side effects Doxylamine succinate is a potent anticholinergic and has a side effect profile common to such drugs, including dry mouth, ataxia, urinary retention, drowsiness, memory problems, inability to concentrate, hallucinations, psychosis, and a marked increased sensitivity to external stimuli. Like many hypnotics, it should not be combined with other antihistamines, such as cetirizine Zyrtec, or diphenhydramine Benadryl, as this combination can increase the risk of serious side effects. Using doxylamine over a long period of time is not recommended. However, the drug is not addictive, and withdrawal effects are unlikely to be experienced with prolonged use. Because of its relatively long elimination half-life, 10 to 12 hours, doxylamine is associated with daytime, next-day drowsiness, grogginess, dry mouth, and tiredness when used as a hypnotic. The shorter elimination half-life of diphenhydramine, 4 to 8 hours, may give it an advantage over doxylamine in this regard. Unlike with diphenhydramine, case reports of coma and rhabdomyolysis have been reported with doxylamine. Toxicity Doxylamine succinate is generally safe for administration to healthy adults. The median lethal dose LD50, is estimated to be 50 to 500 mg per kilogram in humans. Symptoms of overdose may include dry mouth, dilated pupils, insomnia, night terrors, euphoria, hallucinations, seizures, rhabdomyolysis, and death. Fatalities have been reported from doxylamine overdose. These have been characterized by coma, tonic-clonic, or grand mal, seizures and cardiorespiratory arrest. Children appear to be at a high risk for cardiorespiratory arrest. A toxic dose for children of more than 1.8 mg per kilogram has been reported. A 3-year-old child died 18 hours after ingesting 1,000 mg doxylamine succinate. Rarely, an overdose results in rhabdomyolysis and acute renal failure. Studies of doxylamine's carcinogenicity in mice and rats have produced positive results for both liver and thyroid cancer, especially in the mouse. The carcinogenicity of the drug in humans is not well studied, and the IARC lists the drug as not classifiable as to its carcinogenicity to humans. Pharmacology Pharmacodynamics Doxylamine acts primarily as an antagonist of the histamine H1 receptor. This action is responsible for its antihistamine and sedative effects. The drug also acts as an antagonist of the muscarinic acetylcholine receptors to a lesser extent. This action is responsible for the anticholinergic and, at high doses, deliriant effects of doxylamine. Pharmacokinetics the bioavailability of doxylamine is 24.7% for oral administration and 70.8% for intranasal administration. The Tmax of doxylamine is 1.5 to 2.5 hours. Its elimination half-life is 10 to 12 hours. Doxylamine is metabolized in the liver primarily by the cytochrome P450 enzymes CYP2D6, CYP1A2, and CYP2C9. The main metabolites are N-desmethyldoxylamine, N, and didesmethyldoxylamine, and doxylamine N-oxide. Doxylamine is eliminated 60% in the urine and 40% in feces. History 
Doxylamine is a first-generation antihistamine, first reported in 1949. Society and culture Formulations Doxylamine is primarily used as the succinic acid salt, doxylamine succinate. It is the sedating ingredient of NyQuil, generally in combination with dextromethorphan and acetaminophen. In Commonwealth countries, such as Australia, Canada, South Africa, and the United Kingdom, doxylamine is available prepared with paracetamol, acetaminophen, and codeine under the brand name Dolost, Propane Plus, Sindol, UK version no longer contains doxylamine as of 2015, or Mersindol, as treatment for tension headache and other types of pain. Doxylamine succinate is used in general over the counter sleep aids branded as Somnil, South Africa, Dozyl, Denormal, Lidine, France, Russian Federation, Dormadina, Spain, Portugal, Restivit, Unisom 2, and Sleep Aid, Generic, Australia. In the United States, Doxylamine succinate is the active ingredient in many over the counter sleep aids branded under various names. Doxylamine succinate and pyridoxine vitamin B6, are the ingredients of diclegis, approved by the FDA in April 2013 becoming the only drug approved for morning sickness with a Class A safety rating for pregnancy. In Canada, Doxylamine succinate and pyridoxine vitamin B6, are the ingredients of declectin, which is used to prevent morning sickness. It is also available in combination with vitamin B6 and folic acid under the brand name Evanorm, marketed by Ion Healthcare. In India, doxylamine preparations are available typically in combination with pyridoxine that may also contain folic acid. Doxylamine usage is thus restricted for pregnant women. References